Well everybody, we finally got some good news related to Blade, as a brand new writer and director have been brought on board, things are finally starting to look good for the Daywalker. So obviously Marvel Studios has been searching for a new director and new writers ever since the former ones stepped away a couple of months ago at this point. We've known a couple things that were happening behind the scenes. Blade himself, Mahershal Ali, was not a fan of the script. And it was said to be on the cheaper side and kind of a quick and dirty let's get this out the door. And obviously they were trying to figure out what to do next with it and who exactly would be the perfect person for the job. Well, the good news is, it's somebody that if you've seen Lovecraft Country, you're familiar with their work. And hopefully I pronounced this name right, but the director will be Jan Dimanji, who was responsible recently for directing HBO's pilot for Lovecraft Country, and he will be joined by Michael Strawberry, who will also be co-writing the script with him. And this is supposed to be a entire from the ground rewrite and a new direction for the character. So again, it seems like that they have some ideas. And according to reports from what we're hearing already from the Hollywood Reporter and others coming to add details on top of this, this thing is allegedly going to be a lot more darker than the previous Inception. And they're possibly looking to make this really violent and something that sticks out in the MCU. Hence why they brought this team on because they're familiar with, uh, well, what they've done so far and their big pitch. So honestly, um, I'm excited by this. Anything Blade, I need it. This is exciting news. I'm excited to see what happens next and what they're going to say about this and uh, how fast we can uh, start getting some details. Because again... This film is coming at us in September of 2024, so they got enough time now to do a really good rewrite, hopefully get this thing as tight as possible, and give us honestly what we all want from Blade, which is just a good Blade film. We haven't had one since Blade 2, and I'll argue that the TV series was good on Spike TV, and I'll, I'll live by that forever, but um... Yeah, it, it's time, and hearing that Ali was involved with handpicking these guys as well, should be reassuring, which means he's probably already talked to them and they all agree upon some idea that Marvel Studios likes how they're going to hopefully execute this. So things are sounding pretty awesome. <laughs>